again, I would like to thank MedShare for inviting me here at San Leandro. I had a short sharing of my experiences with my medical missions, of course, with the support of MedShare. And with me is Shana, who will be uh, sharing also some more information about what MedShare is all about. And uh, uh, I'm so thankful also for, sh again, receiving donations for my forthcoming trip on November 26, very timely that I'll be hand carrying some food stuff and some uh, hygiene kits. In fact, the, the kit will be placed here. We have some soap, we have some lotion here, <laughs> and uh, of course, um, Shana will tell us more about some other uh, donations that are ready for the Philippines and some other countries that would need this stuff here. Sure. Okay, so my name is Shana Hassel. I'm the MedShare Volunteer Program Manager in the Western Region, and we host about 8,500 volunteer sessions a year. And everything that MedShare gets from our supply partners, um, both manufacturers and distributors, and also hospitals around the Bay Area, are sorted by volunteers. Uh, if you pan around, you'll see the, the sort room. Uh, we have volunteers do a first sort project, which is putting everything into these really general categories. And then when we get enough of each category, then we do a second sort. And so uh, you can get a, a kind of a view of our, of our warehouse. MedShare has, has shipped to, uh, to 105 countries. And uh, you're seeing just some of the flags of 105 countries. The Philippines, we have sent 30 different 40-foot uh, containers. So each one of those, uh, each one of those 40-foot containers treats about 12,500 people, and it's a mix of both medical supplies and medical equipment. And so um, those are really exciting uh, containers and and gifts to the to hospitals and clinics in the Philippines who have uh, lower access to quality medical supplies than uh, we do in the United States. So MedShare is respecting the dignity uh, and, and you know, providing respect to, uh, to the, the patients that go um, to these hospitals and need uh, medical care. So we do that in many different ways, uh, through the 40-foot ocean containers that I mentioned, directly partnering with a hospital or clinic, but also through the medical supply store, which you see behind me. So uh, physicians like Dr. Melendez can come in and get uh, donated medical supplies. We give them a box and a shopping cart, and they just have to fill out a short application on our website, and they can have access to all these medical supplies and personal hygiene items and things like our clean birthing kit. So uh, the clean birthing kit is designed uh, for women who are giving birth in, in, a, in a rural setting outside of a medical facility, which is the majority of births in the developing world. Uh, happen outside of a hospital or a clinic and so this is a um, an under pad for the mother to lay on a receiving blanket for the baby a nose aspirator a sterile scalpel soap for the person assisting it's typically a, a friend or a family member um, they can wash their hands they put on a pair of sterile gloves and there's two umbilical cord clamps for the umbilical cord and then um, they're using a sterile scalpel to cut it and so the goal of this initiative as part of our maternal and child health program is to make sure that uh, there are safe births, both for the mother and the baby. So each one of these kits saved, saves two lives, uh, and Medicare is really uh, excited and proud to be uh, to have distributed about 25,000 of these, and our goal is 100,000. So we give these to medical mission teams like Dr. Melendez, and also ship them internationally on, the, on our containers. The other uh, use for this store is for local clinics. So we have, uh, 55 different partners here in the Bay Area who are free clinics uh, and it's an important safety net for those in the Bay Area who are homeless or low income or immigrants and refugees who need access to these, uh, to these supplies. And so uh, MedShare acts as a resource uh, and a supply chain for international hospitals and local free clinics in the Bay Area as well as medical missions that go all over the world. So we outfit about 450 medical teams a year. Um, we've been lucky to partner with Dr. Melendez and the Beautiful Heart Foundation since 2009 and provide uh, many different uh, boxes and, and supply the medical missions. So uh, next, uh, my job is to invite you to come in and volunteer. 
So we do different projects, as you saw a couple of minutes ago, first sort and second sort. If you're a medical professional, we definitely would benefit from your expertise. But also if you're not, um, we, we do a training and an orientation. So anyone, even if you don't have medical expertise, uh, can, can help us in the volunteer program. So you can join us uh, to volunteer by going on MedShare's website. Uh, you, it's medshare.org forward slash volunteer. And then uh, you click on the region that you'd like to volunteer. If you're in the Bay Area, you'll click on Northern California. Um, but if you're in Atlanta, Georgia, or New York, or New Jersey, we also have two other locations. And you can, uh, you'll be asked to create an account, and then you'll see all of our open sessions. So we do volunteer sessions from Tuesday to Saturday, both morning and afternoon, so 9 a.m. and 1 p.m and you can just pick whatever works for your schedule. So that's what's unique about MedShare's volunteer program is we only ask you to dedicate three hours, as often as you want, but um, that's the minimum commitment is just a three hour uh, session. So please come in and join us. If you have any questions, you can call 510-567-7070 and then press uh, the button that's for volunteering. Uh, but many of the questions are answered on our website, medshare.org forward slash volunteer. Thank you.